myself. Alright, I got my comp combo ready again. Where'd you go? You dropped down there? Yep. end all right I'm, I'm over here just lead him to me did he come around he's behind oh, yeah. me right he's here he's right there More zombies too so yeah one's coming through the front right now take care of him and I'll clean up in here see what they destroyed they didn't destroy any of our uh, forges or anything we need a uh, iron bars ASAP for the front gate we also need them for the side. Something broke in here. Some metal fell. Yeah, something metal fell, but I don't know what. They didn't break anything. But we'll we'll check stuff out after we patch it after I patch stuff up here. It won't let me. Oh damn, there's still like remnants of like a mini horde. Down to the uh What do you want to call it? Southeast. Oh, they're kind of going away. Oh, I hurt myself. I just got to get uh, bars back so I can concrete. We gotta find bars. Yeah, technically we're still breached because remember the garage has a hole in it and, and the, uh, the well, I gotta west the side wall. of the compound has a hole in it too. Yeah, I got to get that patched up and that's what I'm after getting that patched up but I don't want her to scream that's the problem yeah we'll wait for her to die you know I only got three skill points so I'm not sure six of them level 68 now I got nine skill points yeah I'm level 80 uh, cool headshot I'm definitely going with range perks. Fuck that. I was shooting some of those radioactives once and their head was popping off, and that was enough for me to spend that perk, you know? Yeah. Two so, more levels and I can make steel. Yeah, and we can make a Jeep. Jeep is level 85. Mm. A 9 intellect, but I got 10, so I ain't worried about that. Um... So, what should I perk into? What are you saying? Explosive weapons? No, 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 boom headshot. Boom headshot is not only to reach it, to level it up, you need to, you're increasing your ranged weapon damage and accuracy every time you level up perception. Then when you do level up boom headshot, you further increase by a, a significant amount, you know, 20% each time. Weapons. Headshot, headshot damage by 60% plus 5% chance to explode heads on him. Yeah. yeah. That's what I have now. Yeah, I, I, br I bumped it up to 10, uh, like level 4, and I think I'm going to go up even higher. Yeah. Uh, so we need two iron, iron bars there. Uh, we're going to need 
four for the front. I'm so surprised that they actually didn't breach inside inside. I don't know how that one got inside. Whoops. I need to do that. Um they they went in through the garage door. Oh yeah. And then they and then they not only went through the garage door, they then breached through the side of the garage into into this main chamber. Which seems to be where they like to go. They really like this chamber. Uh, it was brick, that's why. Yeah. At one point I was hoping to... I honestly... How did that zombie get into the base? I have no clue. There's nothing broken in here whatsoever. <laughs> Only thing that they took out was the... Um... The door at the very, very end. Yeah. That's a that good company? point. Huh. I thought he came through this garage side, like he busted through over here, but then I thought about it and I was like, wait, there's no holes in the base. Nope. Yeah. Spend day 29 recuperating. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. We gotta get a bunch of forged iron too so we can start uh, repairing all the iron bars. Or we need the forged steel to repair the reinforced steel. I got a bunch of forged steel coming. Okay. And we're going to need... Uh, forged steel. We're going to replace our bullets, so we're going to need a bunch of... Mainly... We mainly need... Uh, what we do you want to call it? Badly. Brass or, char or the charcoal. Brass and charcoal. Which brass can only be farmed from scavenging, and charcoal can only be acquired through the rocks or going to the burn lands. Which I don't even know the yield of going to the burn lands, like how much we'd get. I swear, I think we got a small horde. Are you fighting them or are you just sitting inside? I'm about to go out and fight them, but... Got her. Oh, I hear vultures. 30. Pick of the devil. He's above us. Yeah, I see him. So hard to hit when they're flying. Yeah, I'm trying to get his attention. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it flew right into that one. That was a good shot. Thanks. Forty two feathers. Yeah, trying to lead him a little bit, you know? I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> wow, Sweet. some of these are hurting. Yeah. I got <laughs> a bunch of forge steel coming in, so. That uses forged Not iron. Forged yeah. Forged iron, I meant. Right here, I'm going to Yeah, I got forged iron. I'm about to repair it all. Wow. Like, like literally, like, one health left. Some of them. Like, one or two. We do need to have forged steel for the doors, probably. Yeah, like the front door is very much hurting. Probably just gonna mine. Like mine, and I'm gonna grab a whole shitload of clay right now. Then I might just go down to the mine and start mining. Just getting iron for days. I wanna have so much fucking iron that when we go like out tomorrow, like on day 30, we have, you know, 20,000 iron smelted, you know? Yeah. Just, just going. We could just meet. I want to be able to click like make 400 forged steel and just walk away, you know, and like yeah. go do something for a day while it's going. Because we we need to build motorcycles for sure. Yeah, I was told that motorcycles are good to have, other than the four x four. At this point, I think we might as well just bite the bullet and make the motorcycles because we're not going to get the four x four for a while. Yeah. And we need to start, like, being able to, like, I need charcoal. Brrr, ride down to the, you know, uh, burn zone, you know, gather a whole, spend a whole day in there and leave, you know. Versus, like, spending half a day running to it. 
We got a screamer on the uh, northern northwest side. I'm gonna try a sniper from over here. All right. Oh, I think I got her. I think you did. I'm already noticing a damage increase from the uh, specking in in the perception tree. You know. Yeah. Yeah, it's not taking me much either to kill him now. All right, it says it's only like five percent range damage. You know, it's like your bows do five. Your, I think it's because it's it's a it's several different perks compounding. It's like you you don't just have the, you know, one doing the, the, the you need the skill to even unlock the perk. You know, so you upgrade your skill and you know perception, and then every time you do a level, that's five percent damage. I think. And then you do a perk on top of that. Did some damage to this freaking fort steel thing. Phew. Just, Please. just, just somewhere else. You know, it doesn't have to be far. We just need to build a whole base, a structure that its sole purpose is to run there on Horde Night and fight from there. So then, a our main base doesn't get damaged, and b we can design a base that's meant for like corralling and controlling the AI. And then uh, it'll be a lot easier to deal with them. I've seen a few designs online that are like, not foolproof, like you still have to kill all the zombies, but like the AI kind of just runs in laps and like they, and they run in an indefinite loop and they don't ever like actually get to a wall. Hmm. So you can sit there and kill all the zombies. Um, and get all the experience too. They're not getting, you know, destroyed by walls or by spikes. Making force do like crazy right now. 